song Sean Bradley to uh, songs called Drum. You know, I moved down here uh, from College Station, and uh, I've been playing the guitar for a while. And uh, my first show was at, at a, it's no longer there, but it was called Texas Coffee Company. And then I ended up going on to Blaine's Pub. Um, graduated college here at Angelo State University here in San Angelo, and uh, been doing music ever since, off and on, I guess. Well, didn't I tell you to leave her alone? She don't want you. Man, a good country song. Uh, well, it's kind of cliche, but it's three chords in the truth. So tell me, do you want to fight? Do you think you can win? Oh, uh, I guess for the truth, uh, everything I write is true. It's usually how I lived or what I lived or experience. Um, basically, I, I write what I know and what I've lived. Hey, my name is Cleet Bradley Carrillo. Um, I'm lead singer of Cleet Bradley in the Mood. We're playing here in San Angelo, Texas at the Stock Show Rodeo. You know, to, to play, I've, I've always wanted to play the Beer Barn, and um, I've never, I've never played it. This is the first time I've ever done it. Usually I'm playing at Blaine's or somewhere, you know, in town by the time the rodeo's over. Um, it's kind of cool to play the, the, the Beer Barn. I, I guess is what we still call it, you know. Um, I'd be glad to do it again, you know, it's one of those things where you've got a good crowd, good people, it's everyone I know from family, I say family, I mean they're family to me, maybe not blood, but they're still family, and friends, and they're people I've known for the last 15 years. Hey Beth, this is real. Man, when I, when I wrote Hey Beth, This Is Rip, uh, I was actually dating someone, and uh, it, it was more like a text where me and her were texting each other and she'd be like, hey Rip, what are you doing? And I'd be like, hey Beth, and it was just kind of a flirt thing. Hey Rip, this is Beth. From then I started writing this song, but actually what, she turned out to not be a Beth, so, uh, which is okay, uh, you know, life moves on. But I got a good song out of it and it's starting to do some pretty cool things. In fact, we just sent it off to Yellowstone, so we'll see if it makes the fourth season or not. I used to rock with the band when I had Buckshot Bradley, and it was more as a party, you know, which is nothing wrong with that. I mean, that's kind of what Texas country is, is one big party. Now it's a little more serious. I rock for me. You can stay here forever. I've grown so much as, as a songwriter. You know, I used to write those songs, and, you know, I've written probably 50 songs at that time. Now I've written over 300. There were dead roses in a vase. And I've kind of written she more towards my, my voice, which is pretty unique and strong. And, um, and I've written more about life in general. So instead of the party, it's more about my life and what I've gone through. Kind of a concept album type stuff too. So it's just a little more deeper, uh, a, lot, a lot more thought process. Um, and I haven't exactly lived an easy life, so there's a lot to talk about. You can run away. You can hop in your car. Let me watch you drive away.